All right, we got a mileage sig on the Mets team. We've switched over. Let's see if we can get a team sig or nope, not a diamond, not a team sig. All right, well, let's do a combo. And then we'll have the, the event one. Nope, still nothing. Let's open these vintages. I doubt we'll get a legend, but let's see. Nope. Davenport. Lark, Bumbry and Larkin. All right. Now we got our SIG from the event. Silver, Dodgers, Kershaw, not his best year. Let's go use that GI. All right. Here comes Hunley. Where is he? There he is. Sixty. <laughs> Guess I need to use some GI resets. Got three. If I don't get them done now, I'm gonna get one from this other event that's going on, and then club's gonna wind up in a few days. So I'll get a second one there. One over seventy. Uh, nope. I'm going to try again. All right. Two more. You went down. All right. One more. Maybe we'll shoot back up. If not, we're waiting. And he went further down. I didn't think it was possible. All right, and wait till next time. All right, we're going to uh, look at the skills. Not horrible for like a G3 type team g2 but i need better so if i was finishing g3 or g2 i would just keep that but ace killer is not going to be active often because i'm getting all these set bonuses and stuff like that um if it was a third skill, I mean, he's not a SIG, so if it was a third skill, I would probably keep it, but not as a top two. Hopefully this isn't as bad as uh, the last time. That, that I'll keep. Um, th that's what I've been looking for, two of those six skills. So Slugger, Barrel It Up, Batting Machine, Charisma, Prediction, uh, there was one more in there, but let's go do Ozzy. We got 78 tickets in. They just troll me with this ace killer. 78 tickets I've used. And let's see if we can get something. Oh yeah, jackpot. So that took me 82 tickets on him. But we got two keeper sets. Well, this is an amazing set. This is God tier. Um, and then we got a solid set on Hunley. 78 got me nothing and 12 got me those. That's pretty cool. All right. We have a bunch of golds and diamonds uh, from just saved up.
Um, so I'm just going to go ahead and see how far I get with that. And then I'll probably save the diamond special training for um, the DeGrom Prime. I'm excited about that uh, Smith skill set. Well, it's also going to be a target of the training redistribution tickets to get his power number up. I think we're going to take him all the way up to eight. I haven't even opened any packs yet. This is all stuff that's saved up as I've, you know, opened the odd pack here or there. Yeah, I don't want to use these. Once we get um, the DeGrom Prime, then I'll go in all in on everybody. So goal is to get everybody up to six first and then working on sort of the no regrets players to up to eight. So the only chance Hunley you know, all the special training is a waste as if I ever land a Hunley SIG. So, given that it took me forever to land a bronze, I doubt that's going to happen anytime soon. So, we're all, all the way up to six, and I haven't opened a pack yet, so that's good. Um, some of my other players, normal cards that have really good skill sets. Uh, those, those will be my next target. We got a lot of packs to go through. Again, just trying to get the, the fodder for special training. It's not too many. I'm not sure if there's any non-SIG card that would help my team right now. There's a prime. I'll Get that familiar prime afterwards in this this next event. So then it would just be SIGs or legends, really. Um, so it's kind of a good feeling to not have to scrape and grind. I'm getting a little better sleep, not having to worry about what free agent's going to come out at three in the morning. So. Nothing. Even vintages. Now that I got Hunley, I'm not hunting for one. I can save my stars. I'm not going to be doing vintage combos so much. I like having um, the vintages for, um, not the vintages, the stars. You know, they had these ten, uh, five um, skill change tickets for 3,300 stars. I'm, this, this is going to replace a couple, um, primes. These are like long-term projects, primes in, um, that I used for mentor just because I, I don't know why, but I'd rather just have, stick a, a regular card in there than a cool prime. Not that I'm ever going to GI the prime. 
But what am I using Machado for? I can't even remember. Um, that Vado has good eyes, so if you're looking for mentor, there's a few good Vado years. The best, there's a 83 base, and Bregman 19 is also 83 base, I believe. All right, uh, let's move the primes and the vintages over. Yep. All right, let's see where we get on special training. 20, 20 silvers is worth a diamond. So I'm not gonna get all the way up to seven with this. I think I'm going to do a video on special training. Um, yep. Again, I'm halfway up. Once we get the gold, so it'll be better. Then at some point, I guess we'll get to combos. But then I'll probably start playing the Astros team again more. And try and special train those guys up. Those guys are all at six, but nobody's beyond six. I got a bunch of normal and intermediate packs. I'll have to just open them when I'm bored or something. Wish you could just change them into special training. All right. Let's go ahead with these premiums. It's going to be a long video. There's a diamond. I'll keep that familiar. Let's see. So what are you guys working on? What you guys get? And let me know what cards you got. Or if you got the GI or the Teams Select Pack. Um, not too interested in getting, maybe at some point, the, the Team Select Packs. But, you know, what? If, it's not just dupes. There's some, there's some bad ones in there. Like, you know, if I get Travis Darno. Um... You know, it's hard. I got Hunley in there as Diamond. He's got great power numbers. He, even a Sig. A Sig Darno is not going to be better. So he's just going to ride the bench. And so maybe at some point in the future, I'll take a chance on a team select back. But until I got, you know, run out of options. So right now I know... The DeGrom Prime, the Familia Prime. So I got two primes. And then I don't think I'll ever go pitcher, but, you know, batter, I could use maybe a um, Conforto or something like that. So I can get a SIG outfielder. So some of my special training will be for. Um, McNeil, McNeil's been consistently good, but even if I get him up to eight, there's two other um, outfield spots. So if I ever get a Conforto, a Nimmo, or any other SIG, I can put him in one of the other spots. And then the, the special training on McNeil hasn't been wasted. So that's the plan. 
So that should take me through March. Maybe March I'll get a Team Select pack. I'm kind of on the fence about the GIing that Familiar Prime. Um, so we're going to stick Hunley in the lineup. Then we're going to have a face-off between um, the five starting pitchers, and so including Ariata and Catfish Hunter. Uh, see which ones, which one does the worst, and then have Degrom replace that one. But I'll keep the other one as a sixth man. You know, if he's in up condition and somebody else is in down condition. Uh, definitely swap them out for, for home matches, for club, or ranked. There's value in having some surplus from those home matches. So it's not going to be completely for waste. All right. Get them up to seven now. We still got all those gold packs and the um, ultimate packs to do. So we're gonna have plenty left over. All right, let's finish this. It's got more silver packs and premium packs. I don't think I ever started with 150. I'll save those team select packs for a later date. If the Mets sign like Springer or something, that'll be something good to go hunt for. Opened a few uh, intermediate packs because I want to get them as close to level 8 as possible. I don't want to him to be like 99.9 .9 and then have to use a gold or something. I'd rather just use the intermediate to get him up there. That way save that gold card for special training. Ooh, three. Look at that. I'm actually glad there's nobody good in it. You know, if you get a really cool card that probably wouldn't make your lineup, you still don't want to mulch them. That, this way it's an easy decision. You just mulch them. All right. Not too many primes or vintages today. Well, we got one the one prime. Glad I'm not hunting uh, Hunley anymore. <laughs> It's like uh, Jad with his uh, Posada. He finally got his Posada. So. Yeah, nobody special here. Lots of special training right here, though. Four golds is worth a diamond. So 60 golds, you're at 15 diamonds. All right, let's get Hunley up. And then let's see how high we get him. Almost there. And then Few gold should get me there. Solar. Yeah. I think two more interme uh, two more bronzes should get me to max. Yep, two. All right. He's maxed out. 
So I got all my SIGs. Um, the batting legends are at eight. Diaz and Lugo are good uh, candidates because they have really good skill sets. Uh, and then McNeil on the batter side. And then whoever wins between um, Arietta and Catfish, all GI. So I'm going to have to be doing some few weeks of ranked um, without any tanking. I've been doing a little bit of tanking recently, trying to get some rank coins. It kills your stats. Um, so, so I don't really like to do it from that end. Almost there for him. We won't use all these. We'll just get them up to seven and then work on uh, McNeil. So Lugo's at seven, Diaz is at seven. Uh, Granderson, I'm going to try and do skill changes on after. After DeGrom, I'm going to save up for DeGrom. Uh, I may need a bunch for a starting pitcher. So uh, I still have 30, I think, tickets left. 30 is not going to be a lot. So, I mean, you could get it done in 30, but it's not guaranteed. So after, yeah, good, good power numbers, good training on Granderson. Skill set's kind of weak, though. It's uh, charisma, full swing hitter, so just not really good enough. Um, but he's got great base stats. He's 72 base, so I really like to get him in the lineup. Let's finish opening these. I got a diamond at least. Two diamonds. And who said I wasn't lucky? Cookie Carrasco. All right, is that the last pack? One more. All right. Rendon 19. That's a good card if you're a Nets. All right, one more. Let's finish with the Silvers. And then we'll be calling it a day soon. Start, got to get uh, Ozzy and Hunley trained up. So, or skilled up, getting those skills to level nine. I have a bunch of skill training tickets, so I'll probably just go to three on both of them. And then um, use the training tickets for the rest. So... Oh, vintage. All right. Let's finish off the special training. Let's 
first we could put uh, Swift in reserve, so I don't actually mulch them. Yeah, there's McNeil. He just does really well. He, I, I, the charisma prediction is just does it does a good job. So for him and for uh, Hojo, so. Almost there. Wish you could do more than 10 at times. I think I'm gonna save these diamonds too. I don't think I'll need them. I'll save them for um, either Hunter or Arietta who wins the pitching face off because I'll want to get that pitcher up to level eight as well. So that, that'll be my next project. All right, so let's change up the lineup. First, we're going to do pitchers. So Place in the DeGrom with Arietta. Arietta and Hunter are basically going to have a face off over the next uh, three, four weeks. And then I'll take the other one up to level eight. And then we'll get in the DeGrom Prime. Now, Bench, you served his purpose. Um, and we'll get him and Ozzy trained up. Granderson's a next project, really good power numbers, uh, so longer term project. Um, but we're going to get these guys trained up or skilled up. And anyway, that's it. Happy grinding and good luck.